All right, thank you so much. Well, I'm purposely not looking at the picture right here. This is no ordinary snake, though. The SPCA says it's a nine foot long boa constrictor, and a woman says she found it in her yard the other day. Ryan Arbergast tells us how this snake was captured and looks into the concerns about how it got there in the first place. Imagine you're just sitting in your backyard relaxing on a Friday afternoon with your two year old granddaughter by your side. But if you turn just right into the weeds right next to me, there's a different perspective. A nine foot boa constrictor waiting to lunge at you. It looked like a log. Um, I was stunned. I didn't know what to do at that point. This quiet backyard in Derby turned hectic in a heartbeat. Cindy Schmitz was near where we're standing right now when this not so friendly reptile decided to pay her a visit. Shock, I guess, is one way of putting it or just so unbelievable this isn't happening. You know, it, that type of thing. And I just was on automatic mode to help get rid of this thing before it hurt somebody else. Thankfully, Cindy saw the snake and picked up the phone, calling the SPCA serving Erie County. Her call got animal rescue investigator Jennifer Moleskis on the scene ASAP. Quite honestly, I, I mean, this was the largest one I had ever come across, and it, I did a, a whoa. Boa constrictors like this one are native to the tropical rainforests in South America. Clearly, this one is a long way from home. Unfortunately, people don't um, aren't educated, and they just think that they can survive in the wild. But it, it's also a possibility that, you know, she escaped. Snakes are snaky. They, you know, they can get around. The snake is now safe and sound at a satellite facility. The SPCA says they don't have a cage big enough. And just to be on the safe side, I asked them what you should do if you see something like this in your area. If you have a, any, any tiny bit of question in your mind, give us a call. The number for the wildlife office at the SPCA is on your screen right now. Officer Maleska says she wouldn't be surprised if something like this happens again before the summer's up. Ryan Arbogast, 7 News Derby.